Hello traders, welcome to another episode. In this video we are going to learn advanced chart formation. Chart formation. Every technical trader believes that there are a group of probability formation, better known as patterns, that appear in the market every single day. Our job is to watch the market on a daily basis and try to identify this set of patterns early, so that we build a plan and trade around them. Learning patterns will take just few days to a few weeks, as the more patterns you find, the easier it's going to be done in the future. Head and Shoulders A head and shoulders pattern are a chart formation that appears as a baseline with three peaks. The outside two are close in height and the middle is highest. In technical analysis, a head and shoulders pattern describe a specific chart formation that predicts a bullish to bearish trend reversal. The head and shoulders pattern are believed to be one of the most reliable trend reversal patterns. It is one of several top patterns that signal, with varying degrees of accuracy, that an upward trend is nearing its end. Here we can see how that formation look like. We have a left shoulder and the right shoulder. We are going to draw a trend line, between the ending points of shoulder or better to say the starting and ending point in the head, and we are going to call that neckline. A breakout of the neckline should provide us, minimum of 80% of the distance from and the neckline through the end of the head. Here is how head and shoulder look like a bearish market but everything is look like the same. Now here we have the Euro USD 15 minute time frame chart. What we can see here is a simple head and shoulder formation. We have a left shoulder and the right shoulder. We also draw that blue line to represent the neckline. Once the neckline break, we can't say, OK, it's time to place trade, and we would look for that 80% of the distance between the neckline to that head high. Here is how we see the head and shoulder in the bearish market. So, we see us one drop down, followed by that left shoulder head and the right shoulder again neckline break. It should move this to 80% of the distance from the neckline to the low point of head. Another bearish example of the head and shoulder formation, left shoulder head, right shoulder up breakout. A lot of traders will search for head and shoulder formation at every stage of a trend. But if you want a high probability trade, you should look for a head and shoulder formation at the middle to ending stages of the trend. So early stages of the trend won't offer a decent probability. Let's see another example of the head and shoulders. The inverse head and shoulders resembles the same structure as the standard formation but reversed. The inverse head and shoulders is observable in a downtrend and indicates a reversal of a downtrend as higher lows are created. As always, if you learn something new, or if you want more videos more often, make sure you subscribe, click the notification bell, and leave us a like to show your support. See you next time.